welcome back to another Real Talk Reaction. This one is for Always Sunny Season 13, people. Episode number one. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell as well. Tell a friend, keep telling all their friends that we're still trucking. Thank you. Uh, where it comes to to say, after watching the premiere of this finale, I was genuinely worried that Glenn Howerton, Dane Brass, was leaving Sunny for good. I mean, they definitely made it feel like he was like, not going to be around for the next season. Mm -hmm. uh, then Jay says, Charlie saying, uh, because there is no one better, is so sweet and innocent, you can't help but feel happy for him to finally convince the waitress to give him a shot. And then for him to immediately feel smothered after 50 years of talking is just chef's kiss. Yeah. It really was. It's so sunny. It's yeah. like legitimately so sunny. All right, guys. Great comments. Let's jump into the next episode right now. What an awesome night it's been, huh? Yeah. You know, even when I first started working at Patty's, this place was way more likely to host a dog fight than an event like tonight. In fact, when I first walked in, there were two dogs fighting. Oh, sure. There were like strays or something that had wandered in. No one noticed. Anyway, the point is that this place has changed, you know? It's really evolved. And it's been so welcoming of this brown-skinned girl and her liberal ideals. They're like family now, which is saying a lot, since the first time I met Frank, he pulled a gun on me. Misunderstand. Not racial. Thanks, Frank. Anyway, the point is, Patty's is now a place where progressive-minded people like us can feel at home. And I think that is worth a round of applause. Yeah. <laughs> oh. You think those liberal morons bought it? Oh, yeah. They bought every word you said. Right. Oh, we've never been this successful. The wine is selling like crazy. And look, it's called conservative wine, but it's spelled with an H because it's like, we're whining. It's a pun. It's a play on the word of wine. Word yeah, wine. yeah, Mac, I get it. I came up with it. Yeah. Yeah, so smart. Yeah, so, yeah. So smart. I get it. I get it. We're squeezing those liberal boners for all they got. We're just going to keep on squeezing. Yeah. Uh, no, we're not. No. no. Do you not. try to keep up? I'm yeah. sorry. Okay. Okay. Well, keep up. I'm sorry. Well, come on, come on. These liberals are easy. It's the conservative crowd we're going after. Oh, nice. How much you thinking? Oh, uh, a little thing like we're gonna make Patty's great again. Damn, was this 2016? Oh, 2016, yeah. Let's see. Yeah, they did not predict that hat. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hello I mean, guys, I guess, welcome. Hello. Thank you for letting me host the planning evening. Uh, Maybe you made? Uh, yes, I made Max famous uh, mac and cheese and some energy drinks for everybody. Uh, it's all he ever makes and it's on edible. Okay, whatever. Let's get to the plan. Uh, ooh, sorry, I'm um, for interrupting. I just wanted to do the unveiling first. Cheese, if that's cool. him and Dennis the building what? Uh, yeah. Okay, everybody, are you ready? It was full of mac. Bam. All right, what's up? What's going on? Oh, well, I, I got into really good shape. Am I hitting the light right? Am I hitting the light what, right? What's happening? Why? Why? I don't know. I thought maybe we could use it. Use it for what? Yes. For the bar. How? How? Well, Cindy, do you think maybe we could fit this into the plan? I don't think so. I, re I don't really know what's going on here, though. Uh, uh, yeah, no one ever really knows what's going on no, with Mac. No, he's, uh, he's fat, he's skinny, he's muscular. It's he's fat, he's skinny. It's, it's really a cry for help and attention, I think. Yeah. So what you do in that situation is you ignore yeah, those. Yeah, treat it like a baby. Yeah, yeah it's it's just like, we're not going to put it into the... That makes yeah. sense. Yeah. Why, okay. did I, why did I do it? Nobody knows. Well, we don't know. Okay. But why okay. Do I do yeah. it? So, oh, sure. Great plan. Mm. I think that's best. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's yeah. really good. Yeah. Can, can we figure out a way to Let's just do the rest of the now because it's dinner time. Yeah. Uh, you guys like me, right? <sighs> so. Okay. Mm -hmm. I have a plan how we are going to shut down Murphy's Pub. Yeah, ignore it. <sighs> What's that? What's Murphy's, Murphy's Pub? Pub? What is that? Murphy's Pub? It's around the corner from you guys. Oh, the bar! The bar! Oh, yeah! Why would we yeah. shut that down? Because they do like five times the business that we do. They do? Yeah, so we're gonna poach their customers, mm. shut them down, thereby making Patty's great again. Whoa! Oh, is she supposed to be a replacement for this? Steal their customers! Oh, no, uh, this is the waitress. Do you guys mind if I get this? Yes, yes, yes. Right. Hey, honey. Sorry, I'm, I'm in a meeting. Are you just. Now you tell me where now. Just check it in. I don't know. Is the TV just not working? Mm. All right. Can I call you later or something? Because I'm just 
We're super big. We're in the thing. Yeah, I'll check in later. Sorry, she was just checking in. Oh, cool. uh, yeah. All right, so what's up? So how are we going to do this? Uh, I'm going to take you through the plans. There's a lot of moving pieces in each one. It's here. Part. It's here. Cindy, I'm so sorry for interrupting, but it has finally arrived, and I think you are going to be very impressed with what is inside this crate. Another rocket launcher. No, Frank. Much cooler than that. Oh, my God. What am I looking at here, Matt? Is that a sex doll? Yeah. Is that Dennis? Well, yeah, of course. Is that part of the plan? No. Wait, what is this? Why, is this Why did you get a sex doll of your old roommate? Because you told me to get one. I definitely did not. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was, I was super sad about my old roommate leaving, and, and you said I needed something Dennis-shaped to fill my hole. Oh, my God. <laughs> to fill my hole. <laughs> I said that you obviously have oh a Dennis-shaped hole in your life that you needed to fill. How is that not the same thing? How okay, I, I obviously wanted you to, I don't know, maybe start dating or do something. Not get a sex doll of your best friend. No, not oh, best friend. Yeah, yeah, sorry, not best friend. He didn't like him much. He left him a, a contact number for where he was going to be in North Dakota, but it ended up being a mental health line. Yeah, yeah. He miswrote one of the digits, nah. and that's what yeah. he knew what he was doing. Yeah, I was no, it was not right either. Either. Yeah. Uh, uh, All right, well, look, guys, either way, it's not weird. It's not like I'm going to have sex with it. I mean, he's going to have sex with that the second we walk out of the store. Second we walk out the store. Cool to have around for like companionship. Now you know? he wants to bang it. And I'm not this is the way she's again. Should I get it? Okay, you know, you know, it? This is just this is not gonna work here. Alright, uh, let's just go. Please get rid of the dog. Yeah. Yeah, I'll get rid of the dog. It was, just, it was a misunderstanding, you know. Like I'm not gonna have sex with it. He the second we leave, he's gonna bang it. The second we leave, he's gonna bang it. Okay guys, I am gonna use social media to spread fake news that Murphy's hired an alt-right figurehead to speak at their pub. The liberals are going to protest, while the conservatives are going to march for the speaker's First Amendment rights. And that is where Frank comes in. A tuba? What am I going to do with a tuba? You're going to play it to inflame the crowd. Dee, we're going to need to distract Murphy's security guard with a pretty blonde. Okay, you want me to go find one? No, I'm talking about you. You want me to flirt? Oh, wow. Look at Charlie's face. I don't know how well Dennis flirts, but... Okay, I'm in. Great. Next part of the plan. Now listen. Oh, I'm yeah. so, so sorry, Cindy. I'm so sorry I'm late. Got held up, but I am ready. What is this? Why did you bring that thing? I told you to get rid of it. Oh, I tried, but apparently I cannot return the doll due to the custom nature of the usage of the doll. Banging its mouth. Uh, right. Oh, sorry. I feel foolish. You had this, Frank. I heard you earlier. I know, but I'm all in my head about it. Okay, now that makes... Ooh. One, two, three. Three bottles of wine. Three? You guys have only done three bottles? Yeah, I'm sorry, Cindy. We just got a little distracted. Yeah. Wait, and what happened to the labels? Those just say wine. Oh, we thought Liberal Tears was maybe going to be confusing, you know? Yeah, like, what if people read it like tears? You know, like, what are these liberals tearing? And why are they tearing it? Yeah. And do you, what is this? Oh, it's just a, a new lighting uh, setup. Uh, it, it washes me out. It's a, it's a better look. Guys, look what, what is makeup? happening look here? Look make so lovely. Like... Yeah, it's nothing. It's fine. No, it's nothing. Like, we're, we're doing yeah, good. Yeah, it's not too bad. Then it's good. Yeah, 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 Wait a second. This doesn't have anything to do with a doll, does it? Come on. Doll? A doll didn't even care about a doll. Okay, well, where is the doll? It's out of my apartment. Why isn't it in the trash? It's it's just doing me a quick favor. Get rid of it. I don't care. Trash, burn, river, just get rid of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, get rid of it. Bad idea. It's going in the trash. Yeah, get rid of it. I told him. I told him. You can tell anybody. You're the one that's been like tapping it. It's kind of cool. It looks like Cindy wants to get rid of it. What the hell is this? Oh, I fucked him. Yeah. Well, yeah, I can see that. Why? Um, because that's what it was designed for. You were, you were supposed to talk to it, not have sex with it. Okay, well, I did talk to it, and it told me to drink this bottle of wine, and then it talked me into having sex with it. I can't, you know, this is cheating, by the way. You're cheating on me. Uh, with a doll. With Dennis! Okay, you should... <laughs> This voice is funny. Oh, 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 go to hell. Go, it's you go right to hell. Stupid thing. All right, right. I, I know, no, shh, shh, shh. everybody, this is. Yeah, shut up, man. This is <laughs> so room. fucking silly. Charlie, I'm breaking up with you. 
You're, you're breaking up with me. I think you should leave. I'm gonna break up with you. I already said it. We think you should get out. I can't believe this. I'm out of here. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Do you have any more bottles of wine? <laughs> I'm sorry, Charlie. He sucks. I mean, I think maybe some fresh titty will cheer you up, huh? Charlie, yeah. the waitress is an asshole. You just look way better off without her. Yeah, no, you're right. I'm just pissed that Dennis did that to me. Of course. Oh, yeah. I mean. Dennis is faster than me. Right? I mean, always has been. Always has been. Look around. You're in the strip club, man. Okay. We always go to the strip club to make ourselves okay. feel better. This yeah. is fun. Okay. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yes. I feel like I'm forcing it. It feels forced. Yeah. Right? What is that? Why are we here? Yeah. I mean, look, guys, I think the problem is that we're trying to do things that we used to do, but, but things are different now. Look, Dennis is gone, and he is not coming back. We have to accept are. Yeah. Why are we letting Dennis keep messing up our lives? Oh, He's man. not even here, man. Like... It's time to move on from that guy. And if I'm being perfectly honest, I like Cindy better. Oh, yeah. She's smart. She's funny. Yes. She's an asshole, but in all the right ways. She's just the right amount of asshole. Yeah, you know? exactly. It's, she's kind of like Dennis, but only way better. Better yeah. than Dennis. Yeah. I absolutely prefer her to Dennis. Right? Like her more. Look, maybe we just got to put Dennis behind us mm. finally, once and for all, and move forward with Cindy and be a new gang. For the new game. Hey, no, 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 no. Yeah. 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 All right, what do we do with him? I'm still so bringing him. Not sure yet. But uh, what do you say we do like three rounds of shots and figure it out after? Hey. 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 We just wanted to let you know that you were right about everything, and we think you are amazing. Yes, yes. Now, we were at the strip club last night, and we came up with a way to deal with our dentist issues and do your plan and finally move forward. Yeah. Guys, let's do it! Is that what's going on? Oh, yuck. Not necessary anymore, so, um... You can go now. Excuse me? I think you can go. You dress like it's 1998. Your look is played out, and so are you. You're basic. Oh, I see. Well, why don't we, uh, uh, see. <laughs> why don't we ask that? Oh, God. Not sure. Well, he did just get here, so let's not go crazy. Well, he did just get here. Charles, let's... you were just playing his asshole to humiliate him. Let's not go him. crazy. Uh, I do lots of crazy things, you know. I yeah. never really know what. in the past. Yeah, I mean, but I like to live in the present. You don't want this loser back, do you? I mean... What? Come on, they're just gonna go back to treating you like shit the minute I leave. But us ladies, we gotta stick together. Yeah, yeah, I hear what you're saying, but I kinda like being the only woman. Because it makes me feel special. This is it insane. makes me feel special. You know what? Just for you guys, enjoy your happy lives and your insane, miserable, failed ideas. You guys are played out. You're basic. Uh oh. You're basic. Yeah, you know what? You already said that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Second ago. Red face. Yeah, 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 yeah. Recycling your material. <laughs> That's not good. Uh, That's not good. Bad attitude. Though. Yeah. Oh, hey, I don't know about you guys, but I'm a little bit thirsty. Do you guys still serve beer here? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna say so funny, man. So smart too. So smart too. You just say so funny. Well, for now. I'm back for that. Oh, for that. Guys, you know what? I think we just made Patty's great again. <laughs> Shut up, bird. <laughs> <laughs> so reliable. Yeah, yeah, you can just count on it. Yeah. Hey, man, did you gain a little weight? <laughs> 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 yeah, Harry made the doll. So. <laughs> All right, that was on season premiere 13 of Always Sunny. And man, I mean, I was getting scared there for a minute. I'm glad they picked it up at the end right there because I was just, this was going to be one of my, uh, this is going to be the second uh, unfunny episode to me right here for Sunny. Um, but I mean, it still, it still was not good for, for an opener for me, you know, from the beginning. But man, they, they closed it real strong in there. I didn't know where they were going, what they were trying to do with the episode on there. But whatever they were trying to do from the beginning and you know all the way through, it, it just really kind of fell flat for me with the jokes and I wasn't really feeling the vibe of the crew as normal, right? They 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 kind of felt like they was just there doing the you know going through the motions and all that. 
But maybe I think that's what this episode was doing because we did do a lot of flashbacks to like all the things they did before on air. But it just didn't feel right. And maybe I guess that's what that's what the whole point was. It just didn't feel right without the whole gang being there. And then boom, they got it back together right at the end. But then why did Dennis drop that thing? Well, maybe I might be here, you know, to stay. Maybe. We'll see. Um, so I don't know what's going on with that. But that right there, that closing funniest part of the episode so uh i hope they are not doing some kind of like we just had to come back and do 13 to phone it in and give us the goods uh i really do hope they just come and give us the goods though and let's just make this a really good season as well um i think it's totally was intentional everything with the episode as far as showcasing uh mindy being like the new dennis and like what that dynamic looks like when Dennis is not there, but showcasing how obsessed the squad is of Dennis, in which, I mean, having freaking Mac buy the sex doll is so perfectly aligned with everything that's been developing with his character. It is yeah. too effing funny. I thought that was so smart. Then the fact that they were talking to the mannequin or sex doll and, like, could, it was getting in their heads is so classic what Dennis does, like, and what Dennis's role within the squad is. He is the instigator. He is the, the one running shit. Um, and the fact that even though they had it so good with Mindy, the second Dennis comes back, they, like, betray her. It was like, we're down mm -hmm. for this because, like, that's what, that's what the squad is. Um, and to your point, yeah, it did feel like it felt different because that's, they weren't operating in an always yeah. steady fashion until the very end. And then you're just like, there it is. Which I think is actually brilliant, especially the way this last season ended. The fact that they took this uh, this moment to be like, do you really miss Sunny? And the whole time we're like, we would not like the show. It's just the direction it went. Yeah, I am yeah. not about this. And then they end it with like, don't worry guys, it's back. I thought it was really <laughs> smart and clever. And again, showcases um, how smart the writers for this show are as well. So I have full faith that the rest of the season will be bringing it in always sunny fashion. And I appreciate the creativity of this opening for the season two, yeah. just to put us at, we were like, hold up, what is this? What yeah. is this? Uh, so I thought that was really clever. <laughs> All right, well, look, thank you guys again for watching another Real Talk Reaction for Always Sunny, season 13, episode one. And until next time, peace.